Hey, it's Matt here from Tradesman Digital Marketing. In today's video, I'm going to walk you through how to set up an MCC account, otherwise known as My Client Center account. And I'm going to go over the benefits of it as well and essentially why you should be using it if you're running multiple accounts. So to start off, what is an MCC account? And an MCC account is also known as My Client Center here. And it essentially allows you to manage multiple accounts. And doing so is really easy. Uh, if you're an agency or a business owner and you have multiple companies that you have to manage different Google Ads accounts for, this is really easy and it's the best way to manage all of these accounts instead of having to manually sign in. And essentially it looks just like a regular uh, Google Ads account other than there's a few other options that allow you to quickly switch from account to account uh, and just save a whole bunch of time. So I really recommend having a MCC account for really anyone in Google Ads managing multiple accounts. It saves you so much time in it. So how do we go about actually creating a manager account inside Google Ads? And you can just type this into Google. I'll leave the link to this below in the actual description if you're interested in actually setting it up. But you can just type in uh, MCC account Google Ads into the Google search bar. This will pop up. Uh, all you have to do is come down here to create a manager account. This will pop up and essentially what we want to do is enter our account display name in. So this is going to be our demo account. So we'll just do um, Tradesman Digital Marketing Demo MCC account. So that's going to be the actual display name. That's what's actually going to pop up when you ask for someone's verification inside Google Ads so they know who's actually asking to uh, control their account or manage it. And you have two settings below here, manage other people's accounts or manage my accounts. I select manage other people's accounts because we're in an agency and we're managing other people's accounts. If you're managing your own accounts, you can select that if you wish to do so. But for most accounts, you just want to hit select other people's accounts because you'll be more than likely doing that. Uh, you can also set up the billing country time time zone and currency below whatever is more applicable to you. Make sure to set this correctly because you're not going to be able to go back and change it. So that's very important. Set up the billing country, set up the time zone and set up the currency you'll be operating in. The next thing we want to do is hit submit. And that's it. We're done. And all we have to do now is hit explore our account and we are good to go. We have successfully created our MCC account inside Google Ads, otherwise known as the My Client Center. I'm gonna walk you through a little bit inside this account and essentially show you what to do when it comes to adding people's accounts. All we have to do is come over here to accounts and this is gonna actually pop up with a green little plus icon here and it's gonna be blank. So what we have to do to actually add accounts into this is hit the big blue plus icon and then what we're gonna do is hit link existing account. If we're creating a new account, this will actually create a new Google Ads account. That's not something we want to do. We don't want to create another manager account. All we want to do is link existing accounts to our actual MCC account. So if someone already has an account, we're just linking it to it and allowing us to manage it through this. If you want to create you know, a new account for your own business or maybe a potential client and you wanna set up everything on your own, you could create a new account. But for the vast majority of scenarios, people generally already have their Google Ads accounts. Uh, they much prefer having all the billing information and stuff on their side. So I much prefer doing it through the linking existing account method just because uh, we don't have access to all the billing information through the MCC account. It's very nice. It's very uh, secure and private. And I don't want to get into the business of like messing around with people's payments. It's just not fun. So I always go with link existing account. And once we click that, uh, this is going to pop up and you're going to be prompted to enter in a 10 digit number. Now you can enter in a whole bunch of potential customer IDs, uh, but generally I just go one at a time. And what you can do is in the top right corner here below my face, there's a 10 digit number. Uh, in every single Google Ads account. And realistically, it looks like one, two, three, and it'll be a dash, four, five, six, dash, seven, eight, nine, zero. And it'll be a 10 digit number. It'll look exactly like that. What you're gonna do is get your potential customer or the account you're going to be managing inside Google Ads. You're gonna get their number and you're gonna enter it in there. And then once you have it in here, you're gonna hit send request. And this will send off an email to their email that is actually managing the Google Ads account. Uh, all they have to do is go into their email, uh, hit verify. They'll have to verify it again inside Google Ads. And then you'll have access to the actual account and be able to manage it. And this could take actually a couple minutes to actually verify. So if it's not instantaneous, uh, don't freak out. It generally takes one to five minutes. It's okay. Uh, I'm not going to send this off because I don't want it sent to some random person, but I'm just going to hit cancel here. And once this is actually set up, you will have an account 
uh, pop up in the actual account section down below here. And it'll say like XYZ company, it'll give you their number, and then you can click on it, go inside the account and manage everything inside the account. You can alter all the campaigns and just about everything inside a Google Ads account that you'd actually want to manage. It doesn't let you manage the actual billing information. So that's really nice for privacy on the actual customer's end. Like you can't change any of that. You can't see the billing information. You can adjust daily budget, uh, but that's really the only thing that you can adjust when it comes to actual finances in the account. But everything else in the account, uh, you can adjust for performance, keywords, everything like that. This is the absolute best way when it comes to managing multiple accounts for any agency or company that wants to have multiple Google Ads accounts inside of one nice, easy to access account. So that's an MCC account, otherwise known as a My Client Center account inside Google Ads. If you have any comments, questions, or concerns about it, leave it down in the comment section down below. I'd be happy to answer them. Other than that, you guys have a wonderful day and take care.